Hey everybody, welcome to the Wolf Pit. Today we're making cream chip beef gravy, also known as SOS. So let's get started. Here I have five ounces of dried beef, and it comes in little jars like this, and it's down the tuna fish aisle. So we're going to cut this up into small pieces. Once all the dried beef is sliced up, just set it aside. Now I like to use a heavy cast iron pan for this, but you can use a regular skillet. So I'm going to add one whole stick of butter, and no, I did not say this recipe was going to be healthy. So we're going to melt this down. Once the butter's melted, I'm going to add flour to make a roux. Once all the butter's been incorporated with the flour, cook it for two to three minutes to take that raw edge off the flour, and then add half of your milk. For the full printable version of this recipe and many more, visit the Wolf Pit blog. My secret ingredient, Worcestershire sauce, and lots of black pepper. I'm not gonna add any salt to this recipe. There's already plenty of salt in the dried beef. Now I'm gonna stir this constantly and bring it up to a simmer, and once it comes up to a simmer, it'll thicken and we'll add the rest of our milk. See how nice and thick that got? Now I'm going to go ahead and add the rest of the milk. While I'm waiting for this to come back up to a simmer, I'm going to add our dried beef. And now you want to constantly stir this until it comes back up to a simmer. And once it comes back up to a simmer, it'll get nice and thick like this. And let it cook for another two to three minutes and you're ready to eat. Now pour a generous amount over toast or just plain white bread and breakfast is served. And there you have it, cream chip beef gravy or SOS. Call it what you want, I call it delicious. Thank you guys very much for watching. I hope you give this a try and I'll see you next time.